Hey guys, in this video, I'm gonna walk you through the step-by-step -step process on how to screen mirror your iPhone or your iPad over to a Roku streaming player or a Roku TV. So what we wanna check out first is that we're hooked into the same wireless Wi-Fi router on both our Roku and our iPhone or iPad. And then also you wanna make sure that your Roku is set up for screen mirroring. So on our Roku, we wanna go down to settings. And then first we'll check on network and then go over to about. And here you can see which network that you're connected to. For me, it's my wireless router that's named X522. So that's the same name of the wireless router that I have to be hooked into over on my iPhone or iPad to accomplish screen mirroring. If you need to change this, of course, you can scroll down to where it says setup connection and you can change it to the proper wireless router. So now I'm gonna go back into my settings and then go down to system. And then we're gonna go over and down to screen mirroring and then over to screen mirroring mode. And essentially you just wanna make sure that you either have prompt or always allow selected. As long as you don't have never allow selected, you should be good to go. Just for simplicity's sake, I like having the always allow option checked so then you don't have to go through a prompt when you're doing that screen mirroring. But once you have that set up, now we're gonna go back to the home screen. And now I'm gonna take you over to my Apple device to take you through the next steps in this process. All right, guys, so now over on your iPhone or iPad, we're just gonna double check those wireless router settings. So to do this, you open up the settings and over on the left-hand side on the Wi-Fi settings, it'll show you what you're connected to. For me, it's X522, so that all checks out. I'm connected to the same wireless router on both my iPad and my Roku, so we should be good to go with that. Now, the next thing we're gonna do is trying to screen mirror. If this doesn't work, there's also the option to cast your screen, which is a little bit different. I prefer screen mirroring, and it's the thing that I'm gonna try first here. So to do this, we drag down from the upper right-hand corner to open up our quick menu settings. If you have an older iPhone or iPad, you might have to drag up from one of the bottom edges, but nonetheless, once we're in this area, we open up screen mirroring, and then it's gonna list all the devices in your general vicinity that you can screen mirror to. So here it's showing my TCL Roku TV, but it's not showing my Roku player. So that means I can screen mirror to my Roku TV, but not my Roku streaming device. Not a big deal. We still have that casting option with the Roku streaming player, but for screen mirroring, just select whichever device that you want to mirror over to. So for me, it would be my TCL Roku TV. Now it's saying that it's unable to connect. And for me, it's saying that because I'm currently recording this video and it doesn't allow me to record a video and screen mirror at the same time. So that's why I'm getting that error message. But for you, it should be pretty straightforward. You might have to enter a pin code or a verification code to get airplay up and running but nonetheless that's going to be how you go about screen mirroring over to in this instance it would be my roku tv but like i said my roku streaming player was not showing up but if i wanted to cast over to my roku player i would open up an app that has video content such as youtube so i'm going to pop open the youtube application right here and then I have one of the YouTube videos from my channel up here on the page. And you can see in the upper right-hand corner, there's that little casting button. If I click on that, it's going to give me all of the streaming devices in my general vicinity that I can cast over to. And again, you can see my Roku TV is right there. But then it also gives me the option of my Roku player. So to cast to my Roku player, all I have to do is select it in that area. And then it's going to play this video over on my Roku player. And this is gonna be the case with many of these video applications such as YouTube, Netflix, Hulu, the list goes on and on. You're gonna get one of those casting buttons and that's gonna allow you to cast whatever video that you're watching on your iPhone or iPad over to your streaming device such as a Roku player. So I hope this video was helpful walking you through the step-by-step -step process on how you can go about screen mirroring or casting from an iPhone or an iPad over to a Roku TV or a Roku streaming player. And the main thing that you wanna look out for is that you're hooked in to the same Wi-Fi network on both devices so that they can communicate between themselves. I appreciate you guys stopping by, consider subscribing, and I'll catch you back here next time.